I'm Jennifer. And I'm Becky. And, and we're, we're Desperate, Desperate House Sisters. Sisters. On today's show, we are going to make keto pizza chaffles. Although I'm not entirely sure why it's called chaffles. Maybe because of the crust? crust? Cheese waffle. Cheese waffle. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of excited about this. Well, I want to get to use my waffle maker, but um, let's see, it sounds good. I've been ready for it for a couple days now. We are to mix one egg, a heaping tablespoon of almond flour, a half cup of mozzarella, one tablespoon of Parmesan, that's what I forgot, and the garlic and the Italian seasoning. That's way heaping. That's heaping. Yeah, it must be the brand name. Boog and Groovin', man. Boog and Groovin'. I think it's probably Italian, not... I know, I just... It reminded Freaky me... Freaky Dicky Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> what was this? That's what, um... It's an Austin... Dr. Evil. Oh. Oh! You'll hear that periodically because it's on an automatic timer. The... It's like, turn me over, bro. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Turn me over, bro. <laughs> half a cup. A really half a cup. A tablespoon of Parmesan. And I got the wrong kind of Parmesan. And then seasoning. One-eighth and one-eighth. Are there calories in herbs? And seasoning? I don't think so. Doesn't tell you, but I don't think so. This is supposed to be two waffles. I don't think it's going to. Thin one. I'm just happy it's not cauliflower pizza crust. I'm not a big cauliflower fan. To open our guy up. On both sides. That's probably way more than I needed to spray it with. So we're going to sprinkle a little cheese. I'm going to put half of the mixture. I just, I just feel like it was probably, I probably have too big of a waffle iron. Okay, well then just do whole ones, that's fine. Smells really good. So we're putting all of the mixture. And you're supposed to sprinkle some more. Okay, so then we're going to, three to five minutes, sizzling. Then we can go on to the next thing. See how this one comes out. We'll judge it by like if we want it thicker or thinner. Because mm -hmm. that was supposed to make two. But her waffle iron is larger. Um, so we're going to see how it comes out. And if we want to adjust it first. Okay. Um, I feel like it could cook a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. It's done sizzling, so I feel like that means. I don't know. Am I on it? Well, yeah. So if it's three to five minutes for half of that, then does that mean it would be like six to ten minutes? Possibly for a full but one. But if I have a bigger guy. Why are we always talking about bigger guys? <laughs> Maybe when we pour the next one, start more so in the middle. And don't. I got some Italian seasoning up my nose. <laughs> Sorry. Look, it's a dead joke. Oh, that too. Got it there. That was very fiery. <laughs> it was very Captain Bob. Bob. <laughs> so the idea is you make the crust. And then um, you add the toppings and bake it. So right now we're making the crust for our family. Again, we've got a big family, so we're just going to go ahead and get that ready. So when it's closer to time for us to really eat dinner, we'll be able to put several of them on a cookie sheet and put them all in at the same time. So for our special today, we're going to play a little game. 
right? Four. The egg challenge game. We're going to suck at it. And I'll have egg all over my kitchen. But it'll be fun. But it's good for the skin, right? Or something. I don't know, not if. Hey, I like your shirt. OH. We want to let each kid top their own. Probably. That would be fun. Makes it real good. I think oh, it smells so good. It smells. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Whoa. That looks good though. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I'll bet the crunchy. It's. <laughs> Do we get to use actual pizza sauce or is there no pizza sauce? It didn't all? specify, but it said pizza toppings. So pizza toppings to me is pizza sauce. So no, no. dishwasher safe so Becky immediately afterwards put them in the dishwasher so like 11 30 that night I get a message from her with these all white mugs she's like it came off and I thought she was kidding like I was like no she'll be the other side you're just oh you're funny no so there is several different recipes or instructions on how to do it so it is our goal to find the correct one. So we will do it in other videos and we will let you know which one really works. People putting lies on Pinterest. Well, that's why we're trying it. That banana ice cream was disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> the banana ice. Maybe if it was like trying to make like a banana split or something out of it, but trying to turn bananas into mint was... I agree. I think Bad idea. bananas and strawberries maybe would have been good. No, y'all. I really like the keto thing. I've done it before. We're not really on a strict one way or another diet here right now, but I like it that you can eat things like cheese and sour cream and cream cheese and and it. it I really felt full and good, yeah. and I was actually like I felt. I just felt like the fat was burning off me like it was actually happening. I mean, it might not happen for everybody, and I know there's that the keto illness makes you feel like keto flu, they call it, for the first couple weeks that you're on with no carbs or very few carbs, your body is in shock. I guess it, it worries me a little bit, the amount of fat that is used in the keto diet because of my stomach stuff. I can see that. Do you know that I have, I've never used it, I have the Pampered Chef chip maker for me. I wanted that. My husband said I was 38 when I'm 37. And my daughter said, so is Juju 24? 
My daughter calls me <laughs> yes. Juju. Yes. I said, no, no, not even close. I like to tell people I'm 23 and then watch their mind Ooh. work, you know. Because my daughter's 13, so. <laughs> I like to ask people who they think is the oldest and the youngest between us. I haven't done it for a while because it ticks someone off. But this almond flour is not the cheapest thing in the world. And Jennifer's reply to me telling her that was, well, that way that in that nasty ice cream was $17. I was like, touche, you win. We will never use that again. We might use this again. So there's 12 of us, right? Not 13. For some reason, I always think there's 13. Like for five years now, I'm like there's 13. No wait, there's not. There's 12. Seven and five. So here, anyways, it's 4 H week. So Monday was Mask Monday, so our kids all had to wear, decorate masks and wear little face masks. Yesterday was T-shirt Tuesday. Today is Business Window Wednesday, but we don't have a business window, so. Support 4-H. Oh, this could be a business window. Oh yeah, that's like our little window. Okay. I have, all five of my kids are involved in 4-H. I have three 4-Hers and two Clover Buds. And at the last meeting, all three of my 4-Hers decided to run for officers. That's going to be fun and interesting to arrange. We've got a community service officer, health and safety officer, and a, what was the, the other one? Recreational officer. We got lots of planning to do along with five, six, seven, eight, ten projects and two clover bud projects. And how many animals? Taking about six sheep for breeding sheep. We'll be take they'll be taking two chickens for breeding, four chickens for market, and the poultry show is the same day as the sheep show every year. Oh. Yay! Each one of us is getting one whole egg also. Mm -hmm. so that's protein. I wonder if these would freeze well too. Oh, I bet they would. You can, you can freeze waffles, so. So when Jennifer came over today, we were watching one of my favorite YouTubers, and one of your favorites too, which I didn't know, but shout out to Brandon Ferris. He is just the funniest dude. And go over and like his channel and stuff, because you won't be disappointed. I feel like, I tell my kids, if you could see the person that's in my head, <laughs> meaning the inner me, I feel like that would be it. <laughs> he just runs a recipe for Google Translate until he doesn't make any sense and then he makes, <laughs> tries to make this recipe without it making any sense and it's hilarious. It's like, I love my head. That's just my thing. She's adorable. I have two little redheads. Our Irish blood be strong. <laughs> High five, Brandon Ferris. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> He's that funniest. But. Freak, freak, uh, freak, uh, Zoe. Freak, freak, uh, freak. <laughs> I've done a, a freak, uh, Zoe tattoo before. No. So we got all kinds of things. We got pepperonis and mushroom brooms and onions. Pineapple. We got pineapple. We got ham, right? Did we get ham? We got ham. Bacon. Did you get <laughs> green pepper? No, I got onion, mushroom. I was concentrating on so many things and I didn't have a list, but I did pretty good. We'll be alright. I want to know who out there puts brown sugar in their spaghetti. Brown sugar or sugar? Um, I guess either, but specifically brown sugar. I don't like sweet spaghetti. I think I would like it a little bit, but not for my, like, every, because 
I love spaghetti, so I was making it like every week, and my family was like, "Please don't make spaghetti for a long while, mom." So, <laughs> and then not in my me weekly and I'm like... flavor. I'm gross. Oh, seriously. <laughs> Good thing you got a pregnant cat. Um, <laughs> so we'll just have to sit down and figure out the math on this, because we just made 14 waffles, or we're making. The 13th, then we'll make one more. No, 12, 13. There's only 12 of us. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but that can't be right because this is supposed to be a five pound bag. And I already used a cup has thing. eight ounces, a half a cup has four ounces, a pound has 16 ounces. So if there's. Okay, well, we can't have six cups in a five pound bag. Yes, you can. How can you have six oh, cups? Six. I was thinking pounds. <laughs> Welcome back. Oh, hi. And it is after school. So we have children in the basement being loud and dogs running around eating and drinking and sliding loud cups on the tables. We're going to try to get each other to smack an egg. Smack it real good. So I'm sure you guys have all seen this challenge with your friends where like you touch it, touch it, touch it. Somebody picks it up. You either smack the egg before you do this. Come on, you gotta be harder than that. Jabecky. But Jennifer and Jabecky, that's what our mom used to call us. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <sighs> Oh, 
Okay, we're back. Mark. Okay, so <laughs> my family gave it a 2.6. Yeah, there we go. And mine gave it a 2.8. So... I really liked it as far as diet food goes. I would totally eat that. Again, I'm glad it didn't have cauliflower. Kids did not care for it that much. One of them. Yeah. The one I who doesn't eat, ever eat anything. I think I needed more sauce. But hey, don't forget to like and subscribe and follow us on our stuff. Have a great week. <laughs> on another note, at all those people who are suffering from COVID and the families right now, we are behind you and praying for you. A good special friend of ours is sick right now and we just... We know she watches our video, so. And we also want to let you know, hashtag diabetes sucks. And so does COVID. And so does COVID.